Hello people, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we are just continuing with our Jupyter Notebook series. Uh, this is a very common error that we get when we try to import some libraries. Uh, when you try to do it from Jupyter Notebook, uh, I'll, I'll show you a trick how you can straight away go ahead and install those libraries from Jupyter Notebook itself without uh, you know going into the command prompt or PowerShell. So this is a very quick trick. I mean, uh, uh, it, it really makes my life easier when I try to uh, do anything with Jupyter Notebooks and I have to import any libraries. So the, the command is very simple. The same pip install works, but there is a small catch. Uh, what you need to do is you need to give an ex exclamation mark. So that's that's how uh, Jupyter Notebook installs that library. So we will do a demo of that. This this video will be very quick. It's just to resolve the module not found error. So, uh, for example, in this in this video, uh, I'll show you uh, how I'll try to import Plotly, and and Plotly will give me an error. Uh, if you see the screen, the error is the module not found. So no module named Plotly was found. So let's start the quick demo. What I'm gonna do is first I'll show you how if you import uh, like I have got the requests library already installed so if I do a uh, import requests it runs fine it runs fine and if I try to import plotly I get the error module not found error so what we're gonna do is just type exclamation mark so you start with exclamation mark it's it's a uh, I mean, uh, this is how you install the libraries from Jupyter Notebook uh, and then go ahead with the pip install. So exclamation mark pip install plotly and you can see this R glass says, I mean, that means it is installing at the background. We'll have to wait for the success message. I'll quickly forward this video and you can see it was successfully installed it was downloaded and we have got the plotly library installed now if i try to import plotly again the error should vanish let me go ahead and run that again yep no more the error so we don't have the error anymore